Hey guys, it's Castro72 and I'm here with my thrift store pickups for August, September, and October of 2013. So let's just get right to it. Um, at GameStop, I picked up Dragon Crown for the PS3 and I got it for $49.99 and it came with this art book. This is a really great looking game. I haven't played it yet. Um, kind of plays like Final Fight, I hear. And it has like a um, kind of a, a Dungeons and Dragons theme. I really wanted that one. It's I think by the same people who made Odin Sphere. Next, I also got Pokemon X for uh, the 3DS. Um, I don't know. It was really big at work and everyone was playing it. So I haven't opened this one yet either. Um, and I got that for $39.99 at Target. And I got the... What is this called? Pokemon X and Y Kalos Region Guide for $19.99. Have not opened yet. Uh, opened this book yet either. Got that at Barnes and Nobles. Next, I got uh, something from the Salvation Army. It's called Harmony. Uh, the Game of Harmony uh, for the Game Boy, the original Game Boy. Rarity four valued at seven dollars. I got this for two ninety nine. Strange puzzle game. I think came with the case. Uh, I also got some stuff from the Unique Thrift Store, and I got a whole bunch of stuff from uh, from the Unique Thrift Store these past three months. I got an Xbox console with hookups and a blue controller. Uh, here's the Xbox. It has that DVD thing. Um, all the hookups, I won't bother showing you that, but I did get a blue controller with it. And there was like, um, what do you call it, the headset for internet uh, stuff, but it was kind of broken, so I kind of threw that out. Uh, and I got that for twelve fifty. Then I got a whole bunch of different games. I got play a PlayStation Two game called Dark Cloud, the Black Label. This one's complete. Got that for two ninety nine. Um, I got Mega Man X Seven complete. This was two ninety nine. Uh, Mortal Kombat for the PS Three. Uh, I got this for $1.50 on their half-off sale, and this is complete as well. The other two games were for, for, were for PS2. I got, for the GameCube Namco Museum, this one is complete for $2.99. I got X-Men Legends, this one was complete for $2.99. And these are in pretty good shape, actually, I, I checked the back of the discs. Luigi's Mansion, for the GameCube, this was $2.99, complete. Dragon Ball Z Sagas. This one's missing the instructions. Uh, I got this for $2.99. And Kirby Air Ride. This one is also missing the instructions. Um, this is also $2.99. I was a little disappointed by this. It's very simplistic. Uh, Beautiful Joe. Also missing instructions. I got this like on a... There was a percentage off on the day I got this. It was like $2.25. And then I also got The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker. This one is complete. Got this one at $2.99. And Teen Titans. This one is also complete. I got this at $2.99. Some kid just put like a whole bunch of stickers like all over the cover. But it, it actually, it's, it's a good, I mean the disc is good and the instructions are actually alright. I also found a Game Boy Advance. Um, the purple one. I got this for $5.25. And unusual, but I found a complete Game Boy Color game, A Bug's Life. This one is a rarity one, valued at $8. I got this for $2.99. And it looks like it's never been played. It, the game was still like in the plastic sheath and everything. Um, so yeah, it was brand new. I mean, the, there was no uh, wrapping on top of it, but nobody played it. I mean, the instructions were crisp and everything. And it even has the poster and the Nintendo Power document and everything. So... I also found a couple Game Boy Advance games. Paperboy Rampage. Got this for $1.99. And Mousetrap Simon. I got that for $1.99 as well. I don't know if you guys want to see how these things look, but the covers are pretty plain. Anyway. I don't know if you guys can see that. Um, I also found two NES games, which are getting really, really hard to find in my area. I got Iron Sword, Wizards and Warriors 2, Rarity 1, valued at $3, got it for $2.99. Uh, this is the one with Fabio on the cover, of course, infamous. I actually already had a copy of this, but because they're getting so hard to find, I, I pick up whatever NES games I can, especially for trade. Uh, I also got Blaster Master, 
which I also already own. Rarity one valued at three. I got for two ninety nine. Um, decent shape for both of these. This one came at you with a Nintendo sleeve. Kind of messed up a little bit, but still got it. And let's see. I also found a gun con for the PlayStation 2. This I got for $3.99. Um, and I found one like a couple months ago as well. So now I have two of these, but I need, there's like a special adapter I need for these. It's not the same as Gun Con 1. Um, it needs some sort of adapter thing, which I gotta find somewhere. Uh, last but not least, I had a donation from my friend Mark Esguera. Now Mark is a great guy I know from church, and he, he's on my Facebook, and he knows that I collect all these old video games, so he donated his whole Sega Saturn collection, which he was going to throw out. Uh, so I got his Sega Saturn. This is it right here. Um, he, he gave me all the hookups, including two controllers. And actually, he hooked it up using uh, the RF uh, wire, which I didn't have. So I have, now I have the RF wire. Oh, and he gave me uh, a gun, a light gun. This is a Mad Cat's gun. Kind of strange looking. But you guys want to see how... I don't know what it's called exactly. I couldn't identify it. If you guys... If you guys can identify it, let me know. But I got all that for free, including his games, which were um, this Panzer Dragoon um, sampler. It just has like the first level or something. And I already own Panzer Dragoon, but it's just a sampler. It's a rarity zero, valued at zero dollars. Uh, Virtual Fighter Remix. Um, you know, I couldn't find rarity on this actually. I know this was given out free. I, I already had this copy. But it's, good, it's always good to have a backup copy. And Virtual Fighter. This one's missing the instructions. It comes with a Saturn. Rarity 1 valued at $3. Got that for free. Got Daytona USA. Rarity 1 valued at $1. Got this for free. Virtual Cop. Rarity 1 valued at $5. Got that for free. And Bug. Rarity 2 valued at $7. Got that for free. Haven't tried this one yet. This looks kind of interesting. I, I don't have that game. Um, let's see what else did I get. Oh, this game is so awesome, guys. It's called the Baku Baku Rarity Three, valued at ten dollars. Got it for free. If you love puzzle games like Tetris or Puyo Puyo or you know Kirby's Avalanche, Tetris Attack, this is an incredible puzzle game. Try to find it. Originally called Baku Baku Animal in the arcades. And last but not least, uh, Clockwork Night 2, Rarity 2, valued at $5. Got this for free from Mark. Thanks again, Mark. You're awesome. Uh, I have part one. Now I have part two. And uh, that, was, that was pretty much it that I got for those last three months. Uh, thanks again to you, Mark. The Saturn stuff was the best out of those three months. Anyway, guys, just wanted to let you know. Hope you guys have a happy holiday if I don't see you again. And happy gaming.